Hello and welcome to Rusty Speeches. Today's video is going to be another skin cover video and today's skin will be Domino. Let's get into this video. This video is going to be another skin cover video and today's skin is going to be Domino which is a part of the X-Force set which is essentially what I mentioned in the previous video on the Psylocke skin. I said that I was going to continue to finish off the X-Force set because it was suggested by Record Guy 2022. Thank you very much for the suggestion. And I basically said that you know I would continue and I said this on Monday's video which is today would be Domino and then Wednesday's would be Cable so I thought I'd get them all done but yeah so obviously 10 skin combos for the Domino skin there's only one style for the skin and I just had a little look in the item shop there's a bus squite the bundle which is pretty cool that back bling's pretty cool the tuxedo back bling you've got a crown rex pretty cool as well but I'm still tempted I'm still not sure whether or not I want to buy the Tales from the Animus, I have enough e-bucks, just literally the exact amount to get both, but um, I don't know, I may do it, it will most likely rotate out today, so if I do want to get it, I'll have to pick it up today, but either way, let's get to the skin combos. So obviously Domino, as I said, is part of the X-Force set, which came obviously Domino, Cable, and Psylocke, which is the, that skin down there. And yeah, they're, they're all pretty nice skins, I prefer, but probably my favourite is Psylocke, then Domino, then Cable. I find Cable's a little bit big. He has a similar body style to Brutus, so he's just a very big skin. For the first combo, I'm using obviously the Domino skin. The back bling I'm using is a Sub Zero Flight, which was a part of the Chloe Kim set, which is an awesome back bling. That icy wings looks pretty cool to be fair. Goes pretty nicely with this skin actually as well. I know it's not the exact blue, but it does look pretty nice. The pickaxe I'm using is the Abyssal Ab 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 Blade. Yeah, Bizzle, yeah, Bizzle. Abyssal, yeah, Abyssal. Which is, a, I'm pretty sure, won the three or won the starter packs from, yeah, the starter pack from Chapter 2, Season 1. Which I basically, last season. No, is it Chapter 2, Season 3? Yeah, well, basically, I, I don't even know what season it is, though. Oh, yeah. So it was last season. It was last. For some reason, I thought we were in Chapter 2, Chapter 3, Season 3. But yeah, so last season. It's pretty good. Yeah, this is actually quite a nice pickaxe blue and a little bit of black because perfect with the skin and the wrap I'm using is a Ripley, the blue wrap I use all the time. Let's move on to the second skin combo. I'm using the Harry, um, Harry Kane back bling, which is basically comes with a Harry Kane skin and the pickaxe I'm using is the Frozen Flourish which is basically to do with or is basically in the Chloe Kim set and I forgot to mention the glider and the contrail for some reason in the last combo but I'm using the holographic glider and also the holo da data drop for all of the skin combos. For some reason, I forgot it last combo. <laughs> and the weapon wrap I'm using is the Arctic Camo, which is part of the deep, um, deep Freeze bundle, I'm pretty sure. And let's move on to the third combo. I'm using a glimmering glimmering cloak. It actually looks quite nice. White white and blue. It actually goes quite nice. Obviously, white, blue. There's a little bit of black in the skin as well. This skin is actually quite easy to make skin combos for because there's a lot of different colours you can combo with. And then the pickaxe I'm using is permafrost to, to kind of go with a little bit of the you know, frozen theme. So that skin, I'm pretty sure, came with skin which looks very much, I think, glimmer, which looks very much like Elsa, I'm pretty sure. Glimmer, glimmer, where you at? Um... Hey, that one did it right there. <laughs> So yeah, basically looks like Elsa. And the weapon wrap I decided to use was the Morphic Blue, which obviously, it obviously morphs around. It's pretty cool from the Marvel season, Chapter 2, Season 4. Quite a nice wrap. I use it quite a lot, actually. Let's move on to the fourth combo. I decided to whack on the Flatline back bling. Looks quite cool. I just really used it because it's animated. It looks quite cool, actually. So I thought, why not? Is that a bit blue? Works quite nicely. The pickaxe I decided to go for was Scratch Mark, and the style I'm using is blue. You can also use black if you want, but I decided to go blue because it's a little bit of blue and black. Whereas if you just go black, the um, top of it will be black instead of blue. But I've decided to use blue. And the wrap I'm using is silver clouds. So be just solely because of the blue. Looks pretty nice actually on the weapons as well. Let's move on to the next skin combo, number five. I'm using the Spear spearmint, spearmint Satchel. It actually works extremely well. With the skin, actually, it looks pretty goddamn decent. I can't even deny that. It looks pretty cool. Obviously, gr the glowing green of the thing actually has, gives it a nice touch. I know it's not really much green on the skin, but it still gives it quite a nice touch. The half and tall is the hand of lightning, which is also from Chapter Two, Season Four. Which is, I'm pretty sure, is it Storm's pickaxe? Yeah, Storm. Yeah, Storm's pickaxe. And the wrap I'm using is Stick 'Em Up, which is the weapon wrap from the newest 319 pack. 
which is I can uh, Zoe no Zoe Clash I was close. <laughs> Let's move on to the sixth combo. I've decided to use something a little bit different. I've never ever used this back thing yet, the protocol pack. I'm pretty sure it's a crew pack thing, and the more crew packs you buy, the more you get basically. So I've got all of them at the moment. If you have each each month, you stay subscribed, you get obviously a different one. So I've got I've got the match style, which is protocol ultimate, which actually looks pretty cool. So you obviously get this, you get different styles. Obviously, let's say if you have an earlier one, you can swag an earlier one on. But I decided to whack the max style, which is ultimate. And then you can choose your colors, which is quite cool. But I, the colors I decided to go for is turquoise, turquoise, and then turquoise. Just look, actually works pretty decent. Almost, almost even, you could even say it's the exact same as the blue actually on the skin. But it looks pretty cool. And you also get your um, your icon as well, your player icon on it as well. So I've got the World Cup 2019 one on at the moment, which is down here. Which is pretty cool. And obviously the banner. So it actually, it's actually quite a cool background. I've never used it before, but I thought, why not? I might as well whack it on. And the pickaxe music is the Leviathan Axe, because it's still one of my favourite pickaxes to this day. From the God of War set. So. Or from the Oathbreaker set, but basically from the... It was in the shop with the Kratos skin. So. And the wrapper music is Warp Field, because of the blue and the black. Works perfect. Let's move on to the seventh combo. I decided to cheat and use two wing back rings this... This um for these skin combos for this video. I thought why not? So Love Wings works absolutely perfect with them. I was even gonna use Love Wings or the Arc Wings, Shattered Wings or the Perfect Wings. They all work perfect. So if you don't say have the Love Wings, you can work on any of the others. Pickaxe Muse is Colden Colden Touch, which is basically the Frozen Midas' pickaxe and part of the Black Ice set. Looks pretty cool. Sounds pretty cool. You can use any of these ones if you want. If you have any of the Ice ones, even Frozen Axe or. You can even use Solitude Strike, it's not frozen, but basically Superman's pickaxe. And then the weapon wrap I'm using is Falling Snow, because I just thought, why not? You know, it's a little bit of Falling Snow, it looks quite cool on the guns, actually. Goes quite nice with the white of the skin, also white of the back bling. Let's move on to the next combo. I decided to use the Retribution, and look how that look, this looks so clean. It's blue, black, works perfect. This is from the Suit Up set, and it was in Chapter 1, Season 9. The style I'm using is neon blue. It's just, it works almost perfect, to be honest. So I just find it's probably one of my favourite combos in this video. It was either this one or probably the um, basically the last combo I made. So yeah, I love to fail a lot of these combos are nice, but I was not expecting this to be as nice. So I decided to combo the neural scratch claws with it. So the blue and the black goes perfect for the back bling and also the skin. So obviously the back bling covers up the white on the back. So it just all kind of goes pretty smooth with all the black and the blue. I'm pretty sure this was from the future future something pack, future foundation pack, tech future pack, or basically the pack that you you get the the um, futuristic looking peely in it. I can't remember the name of the pack, but basically whatever that pack's called is you got it, you basically cost actual money, you'd get this skin. I think it's the, I, I don't know what pack is, something to do like future future pack or something. I'm not exactly sure the name of it. I bought it because it was on sale, that was pretty cheap, so I thought why not buy it. And I decided to combo the blue metallic because it goes perfect with the uh, the combo or the style I'm trying to go for, which is blue and the black. It's just pretty decent actually. Let's move on to the second last combo. For this one, I've used a different back thing. I don't think I've ever used it in any of my other skin combo videos. It's a bunny bag. I just solely used it because the colour goes pretty well with the actual blue on the skin. And also obviously the eyes as well as blue. Blue and black. For the combo again. So I can't say I've ever used this today. But I'm not even too sure what season this is from. This is, oh, from oh, OG Season 8. It's a chapter on Season 8. Okay. I'd say I don't think I've ever used this back bling. That's maybe when I was a time I was using just random everything, random back bling, random skin. So maybe it could have used it then. But I don't think I've actually went out of my way to use it. And the pickaxe I'm using is a chill axe, which is from the Deep Freeze bundle from all the way back in Chapter 1, Season 6. And then the Wrap I'm using something a little bit different, which is Ziggy, just because of the blue and the black. Obviously, there's a little bit of green as well, but I thought, why not? It's quite a nice animated looking wrap. Let's move on to the last skin combo. I'm using the Galactic Pack, similar to the style, with the the combo two two um two combos ago. It's never blue and black combo with the Galactic Pack. For the style I'm using is the Galactic Pack, which is the first one, and the pickaxe I'm using is the Blade of the Waning Moon. Which was from last season, chapter three, season one. Obviously, the style I'm using is the Blade of the Midnight Moon. And the wrapper I decided to use was Slurp, 
just because I obviously it's a little bit blue and I just like the wrap a lot. Obviously, I know the purple doesn't really go with anything, but I just find, thought I might as well use it because it's like the way the slap wrap looks. But anyway, that is all the 10 skin co combos done for the Domino skin. Thank you once again, Record Guy 2022, for the video suggestion. And if there is any other videos you'd like to see, like skin combos, Victor Hours, anything like that, feel free to leave them in the comments below and I'll try my best to get them done as soon as I can. Anyways, that was pretty decent.